Sorry, bud, Misty's not here right now. Oh, oh, great, where is Misty? Do you just stand outside and say that to people? Here, take this TM, huh? Gotcha! Ah, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. <laughs> Well, you really got me, didn't you? What's going on, everyone? I'm Manny and welcome back to another episode of our Pokemon Fusion Generations 2 Nuzlocke. In the last episode, we rocked out, defeated the evil boys, and now we're here. And you're probably wondering where I am. I am actually standing next to the Fossil Reviver because he said to me, Yo, if you find any fossils, I'll be in Lab D. Come over to the D and I'll revive some fossils for thee. And I was like, alright, that, that was a weird rhyme, but sure. And now we're here, so we have a lot of fossils to revive. And there's also some other things that we're gonna take care of that I haven't done yet that people have probably been yelling at me to do for a while now. But it's okay because I'm wearing a One Punch Man shirt and generally that makes things alright. So, let's do the fossil reviving first. Am I here to resurrect a fossil? You know it! All right, so we have a lot of uh, potential. We have four different Pokemon that you can revive here. So let's go to the Cursed Helix Fossil. I have, I have achieved Omeloon. Amazing. If you have ever achieved Omeloon before, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. <laughs> All right, Omeloon. Not really, um, not really sure what this is actually, but it's, uh, wait, Loon. Interesting. Oma, Oma Star and uh, Oma Star and Oma Star and something. Oma Knight and something. So I'm gonna call you. I'm gonna call you. Um, I'm gonna call you Heli. Heli. Uh, oh, we'll just go Heli. That's no, nice and simple. We got Heli there. Actually, it has a space in its name, which is really annoying. All right, hold on. I need to uh, initiate a little bit of a little bit of speed up on this. Give me. A memento. Haha, <laughs> get it? Memento? Because that's a thing that's Drifloon. Oh, Drifloon. Wait. Omanite and Drifloon. Well, that could work. I want to resurrect another one. Okay, so we can get the Poison Root Fossil, which is a Lillipede. So, Lily and Venipede, I guess? Uh, that would be the, the, the goal there. Okay. If I had tentacles, but it was also a bug, what would I be called? If I had tentacles, but was also a bug, I would be called Henry. There we go, fantastic. We got Heli and Henry now. Wow, that was not exactly being ex not exactly being super creative with the names right now. But okay, okay. So I'm not gonna revive another Poison Root Fossil because we already got one of those. So I'm gonna leave it there. Frozen Armor Fossil, Snowdon, Snover, and something Don. I, I I don't even know. We're gonna see what all these fossils are when we get to the PC. If I was a snow dog, if I was snowed in with the dawn, you know, the main man, the dawn, what would I do? Uh, I'd probably just uh, chill and, wait, can I put and? Hold on, hold, I could put an and sign in this. Chill and relax. Oh no, I can't fit relax in there. I guess we're just gonna call him chill and relax. Chill and relax, there we go, another Pokemon there. Fantastic. And we got one more to crack open here, which is the Sandy Jaw Fossil, which is Run to Potus. Something with a Hippotas. Some- I- Run to... Run to... Ty- Tyrant! Tyrant and Hippotas. That's- that's my guess. Alright. A Hippo and a T-Rex. If you fuse the two, it would be... Possibly... The greatest thing in the world. Poscrewu. Poscrewu, there we go, fantastic. Absolutely amazing. So now that we've cracked open all those fossils, I don't want to resurrect another one. Thank you for doing all that for me, I really appreciate that. Now my next question is, how do I leave? <laughs> I'm pretty sure I can just come out here and fly. I should be able to anyway. I think. So now that we've done that, we're gonna go ahead and check out the PC. I, oh, I, oh yeah, Saw Evolve, by the way. I, I didn't I, I didn't even mention that. Saw Evolve, because I battled a trainer in between episodes uh, by accident, so he evolved, so that's kind of nice, I guess. All right, now we're gonna go back to the beach, and I want to go back to the Sinnoh region, because there is some stuff I need to do in Eterna City. 
Something that I haven't been doing and I've been putting off for a while now. Not really for any other reason other than I just completely forgot that I was supposed to be doing it. So let's go ahead and fly back all the way over to Eterna City and we can go back to the haunted house and finally see what the ending of the spooky scary story is. But the first thing I'm gonna do here is boot up the PC. We're gonna access- no! I'm gonna access this. All right, so here are our fossils. We've got Heli here, who is the- hold on, let me- let me get a ghost rock type Omaloon. All right, it has aftermath. Oh, it's level 20. I can't use level 20s. They're too low level. I don't even know if there's a way to like train up in this game really quickly. Uh, all right, unfortunate, but okay. We got Renacoob here. <laughs> Henry, oh, we saw one of you. You're quad weak to ground. That's terrible. Oh, and you have poison point. Yeah, you're not good, are you? You're not good. Chill and relax. <laughs> That's the dawn here. We got a rock ice type, which rock ice type is not really that great either. Has inner focus. No, not fantastic. And, oh, I like the look of this thing. This looks like a really, really angry dog. Okay, stealth rocks, dig, take down, and charm. Has Sandstream, which, I mean, has a plus special attack nature, which is really bad. And it's rock and ground type, so... Interesting, well, at least we got to see what those were. At the, you know, that's kind of nice. We have a bunch of Pokemon just kind of chilling in the PC for now. We have a bunch of dead Pokemon because I was an idiot last episode. It was really... I, I, I you know, I have no excuses for myself losing cute hoots. I will say that losing Merry Balls wasn't really my fault because of the whole explosion and critting thing. That was just sadness, honestly, but hey. All right, so I have to follow Sharon around, I believe. Oh, we have to do all this again. We have to do all, uh, you know, I should do this time actually is I should save before I interact with the Rotom just to make sure that I don't mess anything up there because, you know, I did last time and I got the TM Waterless again and there's a dead maid in here because, you know, if there's something a haunted house always needs, it's a dead maid. You know, the vibe isn't really set. Unless there's some kind of deceased maid there. That's what, that's what I feel like really makes a haunted house, you know? Alright, let's go down and check out downstairs then. Hey there, buddy. How's it going? Let me come over to you. No. You know, someone told me uh, in the comment section a pretty interesting story how they said that when they were a kid... Let me talk to you. I always knew I needed it back here. Upstairs a computer. It could be very dangerous to the wrong hands. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll take care of it. Uh, someone told me an interesting story that they were told, I think it was by like an older brother or something, that you need to follow the ghost of the Eterna City Forest mansion around, and if you do, you can battle him, and he has like a level 100 Arceus, and if you beat him, you, you get like a special Pokemon or something from that. I don't know if that was exactly the story, but it was interesting nonetheless. Okay, I'm gonna save here, hold on. I'm gonna save here to make sure I don't mess anything up. Okay, doesn't seem to be anything here. I feel like I'm being watched. Yeah, just give it a second. Just give it a second. Give it a second, and now I have to make it to the the laptop with Oh god, that Rotom is scary, dude. Yeah, I have to go to the laptop without looking at the Rotom. So don't look at the Rotom. Don't look at the Rotom. Get to the laptop. Yeah! Oh, sweet! It has infested the laptop, and now I found a dubious disc, too. Alright, let's, uh, let's see what's going on here. Loading! Load, loading, loading. You remember like the AOL dial-up sounds? Air or wait, I have the. Hold on. Did someone just say error? <laughs> My character's like, damn it, not again. Blue screen of death. Exception in thread main. Zero one one zero one one zero one 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 zero one 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 zero one 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 zero one 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 zero 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 one 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 zero 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 zero one zero 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 one 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 zero zero one 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 zero 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 one 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 zero 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 one 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 zero zero one 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 zero 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 one one. Jesus, that was difficult. Okay. Oh my god. Oh. All right. We live in boys. <laughs> oh god, that was hard. I wonder what that actually translates to because I know that that binary translates to something. I have no idea. I'm not going to spend my time typing it out. If you want to spend your time typing out all that binary to see if it translates into anything, be my guest. I'm not going to do it. <laughs> Rotogon. All right, I am interested in you. You interest me. So I'm going to throw a quick ball because I always forget to throw quick balls. 
But I'm gonna throw a quick ball and see if I'm lucky enough. Am I feeling lucky? I'm feeling lucky. I'm feel I was not lucky. Ominous wins. I wonder if this thing evolves. Because that could be amazing if it does. How am I gonna weaken you? I have a solid, dude. <laughs> solid, dude. <laughs> I'm done, dude. Whoa. Okay. Ominous win. We should be able to eat that. Oh, but you got the boost. Oh, jeez. Okay, that, that, this could spell uh, badness for Mute Jump here. Unless I manage to put you to sleep. We should eat this. I do put you to sleep. That's amazing. Okay. Giga Drain. All right. Get the damage. That's a good amount of damage. That's a good amount of damage. Okay, fantastic. Gonna do it one more time. Get my health back here. And now... Oh, I'm so glad you didn't crit there. I was gonna flip my lid if you critted there. I wonder if a Dusk Ball works in this area because, I mean, it is like, it's kind of like dusky right now, right? Yes! Oh, nice, Rotogon. Okay. Oh, this thing evolves. It's gonna be amazing. But we'll see. Let's have a look at this. It's electric. Wait, it's electric and normal type. Interesting. It's mischievous nature causes it to hide inside computer screens and pop out when someone is using them. Okay. Rotogon. All right. So we finally solved the mystery of whatever is happening here, I guess. <laughs> that was the mystery. Okay. What am I going to call you? Hmm. Hmm. I want to call you... Porygon and Rotom Fusion. If I... Oh, I want to call you Blue Screen. I kind of want to call you Blue Screen. Blue screen. Yeah, we'll go blue screen. We'll go blue screen. That's that. You, you look like a blue screen. Yay, I did it. Daniel wiped all the data on the PC. Yay, the PC shut off. It doesn't have any power. I did it. Is the ghost happy? You better be happy, Mr. Ghost, dude. I literally just did all that for... for oh, yeah, I forgot the leftovers are here. That's right. That's going to be very helpful, actually. I have no idea whether the ghost is still around here or not. Oh, the full incense too. I missed a lot of really good items when I crashed my game. Sorry, not when I crashed my game, when the game itself crashed, okay? It wasn't my fault that the game crashed, but let's take a closer look at Rotogon. I believe that's its name, actually. Let's take a closer look at Rotogon and see if it evolves and what kind of moves it has, because we'll have it has ominous winds. But what else do you have? Okay, so you have Levitate, which is a ma Oh, Levitate is super good. It's immune to ghost. It's immune to ground. It's only weak to fighting, I think. Has a pretty good move set right here. Wait, it has Magnet Rise. It has Magnet Rise! Why does it have Magnet Rise? Come on, Rotom. Is that a joke at the because of the Rotom fan situation, which is a flying type that has levitate? Ridiculous. Um I only have you weak beak on here is a fly slave, but. I guess I could potentially think about adding this thing to the team. The thing is, like, it's hard to train things. I don't have the experience share and all, but, like, that's really slow. All right, where next? I guess next we should just continue on with our adventure. Go back to Cerulean now. Where is... Where is the... Where is the house? Oh, it's around here. Okay, all right. I'm going to quick take a quick look to see if Rotogon evolves. Rotogon. Does it evolve? Ah, it doesn't evolve. I don't think... No, it doesn't evolve. Ah, that's sad. I was hoping it would. I was really hoping that it would. Unfor, dude. Biggie unfor. Unlucker. Unlucky? All right. Over to Kanto that we go. Though I could split up the... I could split up into a Rotom and a Porygon. I could... I could technically split up any of these fusions. I could get, like, a Tyrant. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. Oh my god, Kanto, you are large. You are vastly bigly. Okay, no, we got Viridian City here. We have Pewter City. Of course, we have Cerulean City. So we go through Mount Moon down to Pewter and then down to Viridian from there. So we're going to like reverse Kanto is what we're doing here. All right. Well, hopefully at this point, I can pick up some Hyper Potions because we're at like the seventh gym badge now and I still don't have access to Hyper Potions. Or I haven't had access anyway. And also, I did look up the... Fusions that I freed from the lab to see where I could possibly get some of those. Apparently, most of those are in the cave that I'm going to be going to pretty soon. Like, the, the kind of end game cave, essentially. So, haven't been able to get access to that yet, but hopefully soon. Yay! Finally! Oh, bless! 
I'm gonna buy so many of you. God, I'm rich. God, oh, this is amazing. All right, let me buy 12 of you. Cool, all right, fantastic. And full heals too, and full heals too. Yep, yeah, get a few of these. Then I'll never have to buy anything ever again. I already have escape ropes. Do I have super repels? I have super repels, that's fantastic. All right, nice. All right, what do you got? You got anything to give me? Girls love a guy who smells nice. You gave me a sachet. No, even though don't really know what's in there. But sure, thanks, I appreciate that. The way to a man's thoughts through his stomach, you know? That is very true. That is, oh my God. I love dessert too, girl. You, you are wooing me. Like, you have a boyfriend right there, and I, 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 I'm, I'm falling in love already. Whipped dream? You're my whipped dream? No, wait, no, that's no, no, that is not, that is, ooh, no, chief, this ain't it. This ain't it. Okay, what do we got here? Sorry, bud, Misty's not here right now. Okay, okay, great, where is Misty? Do you just stand outside and say that to people? Here, take this TM, huh? Gotcha! Well, you really got me, didn't you? You really, you really hit me up with that one. Wow, dab on the haters, bros. Come on, low gang. Let's dab on the haters. Hashtag savage for life. Wow, you really got me, dude. Congratulate. Wait, what happens? All the Kafari have disappeared from Mountain Moon. Oh, that is odd, actually. How did that happen? <laughs> Maybe we should investigate. Hey, I just barged into your house. Give me things. You can for Curlia. I would never, ever, ever trade a Curlia for a Mona. You must be high. I would never do that. You're crazy. Have I seen your star you? Hmm. What if I just like give you a star you? A wave incense? Oh man, incense on the waves. The best kind of incense. Actually, I have a bunch of good items that I just need to give to people, honestly. Like, look at this. Ah, uh, okay. Full incense is not as good as I thought it would be. Never mind. I can give the leftovers to, uh, you know what? Maybe never mind, actually. <laughs> Maybe, I have a big nugget. Is that the one that I can't sell to Mods or is that the one that I can sell to Mods? I can't remember. All right, can sell. Perfect, Route 4. Now let's get an encounter from this area. Let's see what it is. Please be high level. Please be like level 40, at least. Spiro, come on, man. Spiro of all things. Why you gotta ruin me like this? All right, fine. Quick ball, off you go there, bud. Ah, oh, jeez. There you go, this, this, if you don't be caught in this, I will execute you on the spot. I'm just kidding, I won't do that. But still, I, I would be super upset if you didn't get caught in that. 124 experience, wow, I feel, oh, I just feel so lucky to be, to have this opportunity to gain that many experience points. That's great. 124. There you go. That's what I'm calling you. That's your name. Your name is 124, so I never forget how blessed I am to get that much experience. Arbok would have been cool, actually. Too bad we're not allowed cool things, apparently. All right. Yeah, let's get away. Perfect. All right. So let's head on up here. There's a bunch of items I can get and maybe some, maybe some more fusions. Let's head along to Mount Moon. Hey there, bud. Kanto is the only place to have a true hiker experience. I feel like you're disregarding Sinnoh. Considering Sinnoh is literally like 90% mountain. Oh, wow, look at this thing. This is, this is, ugh, this is weird. <laughs> this is weird. Uh, protect, wow, congratulations. You managed to do nothing. Well done. I hope you're proud of yourself. That's an easy two shot. That's an iron tail, but we do resist that. I always forget that steel is not very effective on electric. Always forget that. So I do feel that um, electric type should be super effective on steel because, you know, metal conducts electricity and all that. Wait, is, is steel one of the ones that conducts electricity? Yeah, I think so. So I feel like that should be super effective on that, but oh, you're ugly, but you also look like a ground type. So I'm gonna make a flickety switch on out here. Yes, you are a ground type, I knew it. I freaking knew it, dude. All right, Ice Fang here. And I managed to miss Ice Fang. Congratulations. I'm really proud of you for that one. Come on, man. Dragon Breath, which you're gonna paralyze me now? Paralyzed, yeah? I was I was gonna say, if I got paralyzed on that turn, I'd be pissed. Freeze? No freeze. What about an Aqua Jet? No! Oh, come on. Woo! Your boy has double kick. Okay, I didn't come prepared for that. Oh, geez. But I, actually, no, I did come prepared for that. I have 41 Hyper Potions. There's no way I should lose this. Please, just get this Aqua Jet off. 
Thank you. All right, I wasn't asking for much there. Also, that was super effective. I thought you'd be... Why would you be dragging him ground? I don't know why I thought that he was gonna be dragging him ground. But this is my territory. Well, it doesn't belong to you anymore. Enjoy the magnificent scenery and rolling hills. You'll only see it get out. Yes, look at these. Oh, actually, you're right. There are rolling hills here. Wow, look at this hill. Wow, you're, you're, you're Mr. Hiker Man, you are right. This is incredible. <laughs> look at this hill, this magnificent hill. I'm so impressed. All right, let me get myself healed up here, healed up here. Get rid of the paralysis, which is nice because I have three paral paralyzed heals here. As, uh, of course, they are widely commonly known as paralyzed heals. Oh, we just got the TM for Calm Mind. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. This is epic. Okay. Well, TM for Calm Mind. The question is can anyone learn Calm Mind? Only Saw can learn Calm Mind? Really? Not even Patroner. Oh. There ain't much to see in Mount Moon anymore. Let's battle instead. I mean, fine. I just, I'm just really sad about the whole Calm Mind situation that I've gotten myself. Oh! Yeah, all right, okay, um, hmm, interesting. Well, I managed to get an Intimidate off there, so you shouldn't be doing too much damage to me. But, oh, digging a hole. Interesting uh, little maneuver there, bud. All right, fine, I see what you're trying to, oh, wait, you're fighting type. You are fighting type. I should go into Patroner immediately. I totally forgot you're gonna be fighting type. Are you like fighting dragon? Cause that's actually a really good typing, let's see. Are you? Yes, you are. Do we get the burn? We don't get the burn, unfortunate. You know what I just thought about? And this has nothing to do with what's happening on screen right now. I, uh. That just, that just cuts deep, doesn't it? Oh, that really hurts. And now that means I have like two good Pokemon on my team. How do, how do I grind in this game? How do I grind in this game? I just sent out a fucking, you're dragon type. You're not electric type. I mean, you're not ground type. Oh no, oh no. I don't even... No, go away, saw. This is... I, I, I have no words right now. I really have no words. Why did I get critted? Why didn't I get a burn? If I had had a burn, or if I had gotten... I had just, just anything there. That is just really sad. I don't even know what to, dude. I I, I don't ha I don't have any words anymore. I don't even know where to get good Pokemon anymore. I don't know what I'm supposed to do to get good Pokemon at this point. Ah, oh, fuck. How do I train things? I just lost my starter. It's dead. I'm never gonna have that starter follow behind me ever again because it's dead. Kidding me? Uh, that is that is taken the wind out of my sails here. That is just that is that is had everything screech to a grinding halt. I, I am, I am, all of my, all of my motivation right now has just died with Patroner. Fuck. I just got critted. 
I would have lived a non-crit. I would have lived that. I lived the turn before. If I had gotten a burn, I would have lived. But of course, none of that could have happened. Because that would mean something good happened to me! <laughs> Why? Oh, this is, this is, this is, oh, this is really rough. Fuck, that's so sad. I haven't been this devastated by a Pokemon death in a long time. And we just lost Merry Balls too. One of our other carries. We just lost, we just lost our entire, like, team, essentially, in the space of it. We have, we have SS Jack left, and that's kind of like it. Oh, God. Okay, I need, all right, we need to fix this team. We need to- we need to strap up, boys! We need to fix this team. How do I get a Dawn Stone? How do I get- no, not Dawn, a Dawn Stone. Where- where do you get Dawn Stones in this game? Okay, what if I- what if I search? Can I- can I search this- this Wikipedia for- for Dawn Stones? Locations? No, I- I know items. I need items. Where is- I- I need items. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, jeez. Oh, I just looked on the Let's Play Fusion Generation 2 thing and I'm here, apparently. <laughs> oh, God. So, wait, search. Search for Dawn Stone. I need a Dawn Stone. Mystery gift? What? Oh, you know what we're gonna have to do? You know what we're gonna have to do, chat? You know what I have to do, comment section? Is... This area is off limits for now. And what we have to do is... I'm your guide to the time capsule. It's time. It's time. We need to go into the time capsule. And we need to bring things from the past to the present. We need to reload ourselves with the dead Pokemon of playthroughs past. I mean, yeah, that's what we need to do actually. We really do need to do that. We need to bring back some of the, some of the beasts. From- from whence they came! The- the game before, anyway. Ah, oh, jeez. So I'm gonna have to figure out how to do that. Damn it, that is- Oh god, that is rough. Okay! The team needs to be reloaded, and I need to apparently figure out how to frickin' grind in this game, because I have no idea where I'm gonna do that. I don't know if there's like a nice place, I don't know if there's like a lucky egg that I have, that I can give to someone, maybe? The experience share will help out a little bit, at least. But oof, that is, uh, that is, that is a rough place to be, but... Okay, okay, okay. We we're gonna end this episode off right about here. I hope you guys enjoyed Patrono dying, because I know when people love when Pokemon die. So I'm sure there was screams and cheers to the heavens when that happened. I'm very sad about that, though. So, it's time to initiate Operation Time Capsule. And bring some Pokemon from playthroughs past into the present. So... Make sure to follow me on, or make sure to subscribe to the YouTube if you haven't already. Follow me on Twitch, Twitter, and Instagram too for all the latest things that I do. Thank you so much for hanging out with me, guys. I appreciate it, and I'll see you guys next time.